I just love that Mr. Dinman thought it was a scam. He's like, scammers, uh, I'm not falling for that. <laughs> Have you guys ever tried to play guitar, ever tried to learn how to play? I, I tried did. and it didn't I, take. I bought one during COVID, an acoustic guitar. Yeah. I, I still it, have it. It looks made, great in the living room. Yeah, I made it about 10 days. Then your fingers yes, start to hurt. They and hurt. at that point, you go, I'm not sure I really want to play this instrument. I couldn't stretch to get the chords, so yes. I never quite took. We'll yeah. pick it back up. I'm not Grammy pandemic. Award winning. I'll put it that way. <laughs> All right. You definitely. Hey, guys, good morning, too. Got a few showers. Uh, the last 10 days, let's look back at the rain. The last 10 days, and you can see really some really healthy totals. We were strumming the, the rain chords here over the last 10 days with many spots to central northern Oklahoma. Really healthy almost too much rainfall, but boy, these are great totals to help refill those farm ponds, those reservoirs in the central part of the state. Five, six, seven inches of rain in some areas near and north of Oklahoma City up to about Stillwater. So that's looking back the last 10 days. Let's look forward and see what the data is kind of suggesting at future rainfall. We have some rain out the door this morning in the Panhandle, parts of far west Oklahoma. We'll take you all the way to the very end of May. You know, we're almost to the end of May about to be at the midpoint of 2023. Isn't that crazy? This month and this year is flying by. And this is what it looks like. Rain looks to be possible over the entire state, but the totals look to be less in East Oklahoma, a little heavier in the West. One, two, three, maybe four inches of rain by the time we get to the end of May in West Oklahoma. And that is actually some great news. If we can put rainfall out over that extended period of time and get two, three, four inches of rain in some spots. That's going to help with that drought definitely as you see the rain chances possible here coming our way. As you look out the door this morning, some scattered showers popping up this morning. Parts of far west Oklahoma is where that rain is right now. As you see there, a few little showers from near Woodward, near Arnett, down to Cheyenne, just north of there now. Also some rain down in parts of southwest Oklahoma. Nothing severe here out the door this morning, but there are a few sporadic showers there this morning. Those continue in parts of, parts of uh, far west and northwest Oklahoma this morning. So I showed you the last 10 days. That kind of plays an impact on our mow or no-go because the ground really is pretty saturated, pretty wet, but I know you got to mow. I've moved the, the Monday forecast. I had it up to you, but I think it's a, a, a decent day to mow today. There's a slight chance of a few sprinkles, but get after it if you got to. Good uh, green light on the way for today. A few storms Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday may impact your mowing. So today will be the day that if you're going to go mow this week, I think today looks to be the best day coming up. Temperature's not bad as well. And make sure the bug spray is on. Those mosquitoes, they are all over the place right now. 56 south winds at 3 miles per hour. Mild temperatures out the door this morning at 60. We'll climb to near 70 at lunchtime and into the 70s today. We'll get up to near 77 this afternoon. And there may be a stray shower move into Oklahoma City, but if we see any rain, the chances overall are spotty and definitely look light, maybe more of a sprinkle uh, coming our way today. We're in the 50s right now, most spots, 50s. Got a 60 there in Woodward, so we'll call it a mild to cool start this morning, much like we had over the weekend. 70s on the way for most spots here coming up for today. We'll track a chance of some severe weather. It's not a high chance, it's a low chance, but if it happens, quarter to maybe golf ball size hail, uh, winds to about 65 and some locally heavy rain. There is a low tornado threat but right now that is close to zero. We'll show that to you here in just a second. But I'll show you if there is any hail, uh, largest will be right along the Oklahoma Panhandle border, maybe up to golf ball size. Most of this will be quarter size hail. And again, that tornado threat is right there in that same spot where a few of those storms may rotate for a while. So we'll have our tractors ready to go late afternoon on into the evening hours here coming up for today. So this afternoon and evening, got some rain, some storms developing near the Panhandle. Those start scooting into Oklahoma here coming up this evening. And those will roll into Oklahoma overnight tonight. More just some showers developing, and those will be with us tonight into the early morning hours tomorrow. 60s for lows overnight tonight for most spots. Back up in the 70s near 80 coming up for most locations. A few spots in the west, maybe in the 60s to near 70 coming up into your Tuesday. As rain chances continue, more spotty in nature across the state, but everybody should have a chance across Oklahoma for the most part. And then there'll be a complex of storms developing in the panhandle. It looks like that'll run down across southwest Oklahoma and where that will develop here late Tuesday into Tuesday night. Some stronger winds up near 70, 75. And again, some heavy rainfall with that as well. And as we look at over the next two to three days, some localized areas of some heavier rain. Overall rain totals here in OKC right now looks to be 
pretty low. So as we check the view here on your nine day forecast, we're gonna take you all the way to the end of May. Okay, Memorial Day is on Monday and most days look to have a chance of some rainfall, especially today, tonight, tomorrow, tomorrow night on into Wednesday. Chance will continue Thursday, then wind down going into your Memorial Day weekend. We're gonna take a break. We've got more details coming up right after this.